Welcome everyone to BCC Art Studio. I'm Billy, and today I am going to attempt to put some foil, metallic foil from Artistic Painting Studio onto this cap. So, things you will need are the cap, the metallic foil, some spray adhesive, and Arts Artsyville embellishment, um, embellishment um, that is from also from the Artistic Painting Studio. So let's get started. So the first thing I'm going to do is move all this stuff out of the way and I am going to take the tag off the hat. <clears throat> Next thing, oh, you also want some tape. So I'm only going to be doing the bill. So I'm going to use some tape to protect the front. So, I will be back after I spray the adhesive on. Okay, so I'm back. I sprayed the adhesive on. You can see that it's wet. Now we need to let that dry. Okay, so I'm back, and this is dry. So now we need to grab our... Um, Artsyville embellishment. This is an, also a uh, foil adhesive, so we are going to brush this on as soon as I get it open. So you want to Try to get a nice, good coat on it. Don't be sparingly with it. And make sure you get all the way up to the nooks and crannies here. All the way up to the top of the bill. So you kind of want to make sure you're going in one direction, but at the end, just make sure you're going in one direction. But you can move it around and spread it around. Just don't be sparingly with it. You want to get a good seal. Make sure it's completely covered. And try to get the, the ends of the cap. Now I'm not doing the underside, so I'll probably have to go through and wipe some of that off on the inside. You can do the inside. I mean, I am not going to do the inside because, well, I'm not even sure if the outside's going to work. So for now, I'm just going to do the inside. I mean, the outside, and then we will see. Maybe I will uh, do another video on on it after I see if this one works out. But we'll see. This stuff here, this adhesive, this foil adhesive, has to dry, I think, at least four hours. Okay. 
you should be able, if you're looking for any of this stuff, you should be able to find this on the Artistic Painting Studio on her website. You can find the, the foils, you can find the heat adhesive, you can find the um, some rollers, you can find all kinds of neat stuff on her site. So, I think I got a nice good coat on there, and we are going to let that dry. And I also forgot to say um, that this stuff, you can let it dry for 24 hours. It will never get completely dry. It'll always be a, a tacky. It'll dry to a tacky, and that is it. It will never dry completely. So, just so you know... You could leave it for a few days if you wanted to and it would still be perfectly fine for applying your metallic foils. So we will let this dry. Alright, it is time to put the foil on the hat. So as you can see, you can see that shiny, that is the glue or the foil adhesive. It is a tacky feeling right now, so we are going to put the foil on the hat. So I picked this shiny color, and I hope you can see the different colors on it. I did have some other ones, but I thought, you know, blue goes good with white, so <clears throat> now hopefully I've made this big enough. So when you place this on here, you want to make you want to place it up high enough to get to the corners of the hat. So, <coughs> excuse me. Let is just see here. All right. So I'm gonna take some scissors and I'm gonna cut down the middle here to help spread it out to the sides. Now, like I said, this is my first time, so we will see how it turns out. Alright, so what I need is, so I got a kitchen brush, I couldn't find anything else. But we want to kind of just brush that on there as best as we can get it. I know it's not going to be perfect because there are wrinkles in it, I see already. But making sure I get in the corners. Fingernails come in handy. Now I was watching the, the artistic studio lady do this, this, and she had a toothbrush, but I didn't have one at the time, so I'm like, well, I could use a scrubbing pad. It might work out. We'll see. I get the bill of the hat here. Alright, so when you start to pull up, you want to make sure that it is all coming up. So you start to pull it slowly, and if you see metallic on your paper, then you probably don't have it on there good enough. So you can use your nail and scrape it off. Make sure you're getting up all the way up in the right corner. Yeah. 
I really wish I would have had a toothbrush, but that would have really worked out nice. I'm getting all the small spots and the fine spots. I am using a dog hair brush, which I haven't even used on the animals yet. I just bought it a couple weeks ago and never used it, so I'm going to use it on here. This is where the toothbrush would come in handy because it's small and you can get into all the crannies and then everything. Let's try this thing again. I may have to fast forward through this part just because I'm so new at doing this. That it's going to take me a while. So right now I am just trying to fill in all the spots that didn't fill in. So I'm just replacing it a little bit in some spots. Mm, I'm doing my best. Alright, I'm going to take the tape off up there because that is driving me up the wall and it doesn't make, doesn't look very good. I want to see what's going to happen when I pull this stuff off, so... Alright, so I can see right up in there that I need to get up in here. So if I can use my nail to get up in there. I guess I didn't get enough glue on there. Oh well. I thought I did. Anyway, so this is the results. You can always use the leftovers for whatever you want, but so this is my results of my hat. So I will bring you down for a close-up. Okay, so here is the results with the metallic foil. Now there is um, a sealer that she says to put on and I can't remember the name of it but I don't have it. So once I do get it I will update possibly and maybe do another video on the correct way to do it. But that is the hat. Now let me bring you into some light. I don't know if this light is any better, but so there you have it. That is the metallic foil on a baseball cap. Thank you for watching and happy pouring.